Hello, this is Brad Hunt. As we lead up to the strategic planning meeting, I wanted to share a few thoughts with you that I think will set a framework for a successful outcome. A couple key points here. Dwight Eisenhower said, plans are nothing, planning is everything. And that's truly the essence of strategic planning. The outcome, the paper document that you achieve through this process is not what's important. What's really important is the process, the conversations, the debates, the consensus that occurs during the process. It's those conversations that are the value of strategic planning. So don't get hung up on the document at the end. Uh, that's something that we'll end up with, but it's not what's really important here. Pablo Picasso said, action is the foundational key of all success. And again, this is a key point of strategic planning. At the end of this, you have to do something. You have to do something probably different than what you're currently doing to achieve the objectives you define. So those two key points are the essence of strategic planning. Rule number one, get your definition straight. Um, invariably, whenever we get into strategic planning, we end up in a heated debate that carries on for about an hour before we finally realize the two parties were, were saying the same thing, but they had different definitions of the terms. Um, to avoid that, we're going to come in with a set of definitions. There is no right or wrong way to define it. The main thing is that we're consistent and we all understand it in the same way. Rule number two, keep it simple. Take a look at these two examples. Vision number one, uh, you know, read through that, and five minutes later, tell me what it says. You probably wouldn't be able to. There's just too much in there. Nobody's going to remember that, uh, that vision statement. Vision statement two, very short, very sweet. Um, it actually came from my previous life in the private sector. Uh, we often made fun of this, better than the best. Not exactly good English. Um, we guffawed about it every now and then. Uh, but in the end, if anybody asked us what the vision was, we knew exactly what it was and what it meant. And that's important uh, as you go through this process. Don't try to make your statements into marketing tools. You can do that elsewhere. The strategic plan is for your benefit and making it memorable is an important part of that. Rule three, words matter. Choose them carefully. Again, look at the two different statements and think about knowing nothing else about the company or the department that these are associated with. Look at vision statement one and think about what you think the outcomes are going to be for that organization. Look at the second one, and what do you think would be the outcomes? If you looked at the first and said, well, probably nothing's going to happen because of the way they defined it, least risk, highest available quality, that's a, a, a statement that says, I'm afraid to do anything. And this was a real statement of a real organization, and it, the outcome was exactly what you would expect. So these things matter they mean things to people and you've got to take the time and effort to choose those words carefully that's it just a few simple ideas that uh, I think make a difference between a successful and an unsuccessful strategic planning uh, effort so again get the definition straight we're gonna help you out bring in some definitions we can change them if you like uh, the actual definition doesn't matter as much as our agreement on what, what we're going to call them. Uh, the conversation is what's most important, and that's why you don't write a strategic plan in a vacuum. It's those conversations, the debates, those are the things that matter most in this process. Take action. You don't take the plan, sit it on the shelf next to the other one. Again, if you don't do anything different, then you'll, you'll get the same outcome you've always had.
and then don't underestimate a good vision. I've tr seen many organizations transformed by a good statement of vision. It unites everybody, it makes it clear where we're trying to go, and, and people can align t to that when they understand it and have ha had a chance to participate in that creation.